Hello, this is William from Visual Components. In this video, I want to give you an example of the improvements and optimizations we have done to support larger layouts in the 3D world. If you want, you can go to the eCatalog panel, expand models by type, click Demo Layouts, and open this layout in the 3D world, AC Outdoor Unit Assembly. You can also try loading your own layouts in Visual Components 4.2 and see how they compare to 4.1. Since I'm recording a video on the same machine I'm running a software, it might take me a while to load this layout, maybe 10-20 seconds, but it should be faster for you. So I'll just skip ahead when the layout is loaded in the 3D world. Okay, the layout is loaded in the 3D world. It's quite big, so we have our factory, we have inventory, we have trucks, we have processes, conveyors that pull the items, and workers that process them, so robots and humans. If I run the simulation, everything updates, I can zoom in, Everything works fine, the camera moves correctly, parts are being created nicely. Great. This layout also has views on it, so I can go to the first view, second view, third view. Oh, here comes a truck. And the last view here. We also have some others, so view 6, view 7, and view 8. Okay, so you could play around with this layout if you want to. You could also use the camera animator here to move the camera during the simulation. So if I reset and now go to my views, let's go to the first view, then go to the second view, say after 10 seconds, then go to view 3, 20 seconds, view 4, 30 seconds, view 5, 40 seconds, View 6, 50 seconds, view 7, 60 seconds, and view 8, let's say 70 seconds. And that's it. So let's close this out, run the simulation, and we start with a bird's eye view. Here comes the truck, big rig, and it'll just float the camera, move it to where we want it to go. In and we could record this as a video, 3D PDF, or an animation, which you can play back in Visual Components Experience, either in 3D or in virtual reality. So quite a big layout, and it's running rather smoothly. I do encourage you to test with your own layouts. Uh, that's about it. So this completes the video. If you have any more questions, please feel free to visit our forum at forum.visualcomponents.com. And as always, have a wonderful day.